Wow, I just finished watching the last episode of LARP the series. Good stuff. Now, hello and welcome to another episode of LARP Forge. Now, do you know that feeling when you know that you need to do something, but you don't have the time, and then when you finally get around to doing it, something else comes up, so you never actually get around to doing it in the first place? Yeah, well, that's how I have been feeling about Lab Forge episodes in the last couple of weeks, actually. That's why you don't get the wizard episode this time. You have to wait a little longer, because the editing is going to take a little longer. However, this episode is a little easier to make sure you're going to get this first. And I think it's a little more relevant at the moment, actually. As I mentioned, I just finished watching LARPs, the series. If you don't know what that is, it's a web series about... Well, LARPers or LARPs. And if you haven't watched it yet, I strongly recommend you go over and watch it. Right now it's over on Geek It Sundry's YouTube channel. Which brings me to one of the things I want to talk about today. LARP in media. Now before you go ranting on your keyboards, I know that Momo O'Brien already did an video on the subject. Actually, I think she'd done like maybe two. She's definitely done one video about the LARPs in media, or LARPs in uh, TV shows and movies and stuff like that. And, and it's kind of like the same thing I want to talk about, but not really. Anyhow, if you want to get on the if you want to get on the boat, uh, I suggest you go over and check her video out. It's here. Now back to this boat. Is it just me? Is LARPs in TV and movies becoming a little more familiar? I mean, it's becoming a little more. What's it called? recognized, known. I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I feel that there's a lot more TV episodes or TV shows that handle LARPs and stuff like that than were back in the day. So is LARP becoming more popular or is it just becoming more public recognized? Either way, I see it's kind of good because well, the more people that know about LARP, the easier it is to kind of, well, ease people into it and, well, let it open up for more people. You know, LARP kind of scares up a certain type of people that might not consider it in the first place because they think it's something different than what they're, what it actually is. Now, this brings me to my next point here. Is LARP in media a good thing? Because a lot of times when LARP pops up in media like Supernatural uh, and movies on Netflix like Knights of Badass, um, Unicorn City, The Wild Hunt, stuff like that, it tend to not really get a positive light. It's usually a very much, um, how should I put this gently? It kind of builds very much on the archetypes of LARPs. The archetypes that are, well, it's still a thing, kind of moving away from. Now, a lot of these films are getting really ripped on by LARPers because they look down on LARPers, they portray a bad picture and a bad image. Now here's the thing, I don't really think so. Let me explain. They get around to the core element of the LARP, which for me, I know this is a very personal thing, but the core element for me is the go having a good time, having fun and stuff like that. And you can totally see that in a lot of these film and movies. Heck, there's a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles episode about LARP and I actually think it's one of the best TV episodes about LARP that I have ever seen. They go into detail, explain what LARP actually means. Live action role play. Heck, a lot of LARPers don't even know what LARP means. The core of LARP, it's the imagination, it's the immersion, it's the fun, it's... Yeah, fun and good times. Isn't that the core of everything? Now, of course, I can understand that people are not happy about all these things. I know that my friend Kristen Bromley made a review of the movie Night of Bad Astem and she wasn't happy about it. And I have seen people on Reddit and Twitter just raging on about this movie. But I've also seen people going around the other way saying that these things are actually quite good and they made them start LARPing and they thought they were funny and they spoke to them and they were... It's just that it's different. That's not being said that some of these turds are good turds. I mean, no matter how much you polish 
at her, it's still crap. But it could still be good crap and fun crap. I've now a toilet talk. What if we want something that's actually good? Now I know there's been movies done by LARPers about LARP. Some good, some bad. I know there's been web series focusing about LARP, especially LARPs the series. Ba -ba. Just finished his first season. And they actually already got funded by it. to a second season. Why am I putting up LARPs as an example and not other things? Well, because I have a philosophy that we're moving away from TV and more over to the internet. And I think that the younger generation can agree with me on all of this. Therefore, I think that something like web series is becoming a little more prominent. LARP the series is good. It has actually kind of a high production quality for a web series. It has good acting. It comes around LARP, it uses terms from LARPs, it shows LARP, but it's also more a, dra a drama thing. So it's a drama set around a LARP group. Since LARP is not the focus, it helps to not alienate it and just make it a part of everyday life. For some, a little bigger part than others. <coughs> Noctus. <coughs> Now, because it's being published over in Geek and Sundry, the word about LARP is being spread a little more. Spreading the love of LARP. And isn't that a good thing? I personally think it is. But for every good thing, there needs to be a ton of crappy things. I mean, something like sports movies, they, I, I don't know about you, but I think there might be one good sports movie out of, I don't know, 50? And I don't watch sports movies. Anyway, my point is here, that you might not like what's coming out in the media about LARP, but how can we support this and turn it into our favor? How can you support this? Well, you can go out and say that something is good, but that's not really support if you don't mean it. And it's just like sucking up to the movie, and we don't want to do that either. But I don't think we should dismiss them entirely. Or it for creative criticism, but don't go over and become the naggy nerd that's like always supposed to be the bad guy. I'm not, yeah, it's getting way too complicated. I'm not here to tell you what you should do. I'm just here to say that I don't think you should dismiss some of these TV shows, movies, or web series or anything. Just because you don't like it, other people might like it. Might not speak to you, but it might speak to somebody else. Supporting this helps things grow and yeah, the more you open up about LARP to other people, the more people that's gonna know about it, helps it evolve and grow and become bigger and better projects and more and things that we can really get behind and really help push out there and show people so that it's just like, you know what, this is not LARP, this is LARP. This is something we're proud to show as LARPers. I know that these things are being produced and I know that some of this already exists out there. Lots of the series is one of the things that I want to show to people. And to some degree also movies and TV shows that are kind of questionable in the quality. But these projects that embody the spirit of LARP are only going to come if you support LARP in media and not push it away these things are evolving they are getting better we are gonna get these good things but again then again we need to get over the bad stuff before we can get to the good stuff is it then really that bad i personally don't think so i kind of like some of these bad movies tv shows and and all of this i'm pretty sure that there are other people out there that share my opinion so what am i going to end this episode on because i've just been ranting on and i don't know if i really got my point across here first of all go watch it after the series it's quite good there's the link right here second of all larps in media support it help it grow now if we help it grow support it it will evolve and it will get to something that we can really be proud of. And at some point we're gonna get to where LARPers can get a camera and make some really good movies about LARP. Heck, maybe it's already made, just waiting to be published. And we should just be here and wait it with open arms and give it a warm welcome. And if we don't like it, we'll slaughter it with our foam weapons until it's blue and yellow and laying on the ground and can't speak anymore. Let the flaming inn collapse on them. Let them burn. Oh dear. We've built them a funeral pyre. 
Keep watch. Anyone trying to crawl out gets kicked back inside. Jesus, aren't you a priest? That gold buys Jeeves a new inn and us a few dead soldiers. Now I could mention a long list of movies, film and TV shows, web series, etc, 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 etc. Of things that you should go and check out. So I'm just gonna leave a long list in the description underneath the video. That's also going to force you to read a little. And uh, then I'm hoping to see you a little sooner again next time. Bye.